tackling breaking news all morning out of Winooski. Multiple fire departments responding to a five alarm fire involving three buildings. Let's get you right out to NBC 5's Lauren Granada. She's live on Main Street in Winooski. Lauren, what's the latest there? Missouri crews are still on scene right now assessing the damage. Take a look behind me here. We're told that flames were first seen coming out of this blue building on the second floor. You can tell that by that charred window frame and roof up top there. And also notice how close the buildings are. That too played a part in how far the fire spread. Vermont officials are also on scene helping the Winooski Fire Department in this investigation. But we do want to show you some video that we shot earlier this morning. 12 fire departments were called to the scene when the fire broke out just before 4.30 this morning. The Winooski Fire Chief tells us flames were seen blowing out of the second floor on 246 Main Street. They eventually spread to the building next door and then to a third structure right behind that second building. These buildings are extremely close, four or five feet apart, in some instances connected via some, some sort of sheds, walkways. Two of them are very old structures, what we refer to as balloon construction. You know, fire starts low and can travel freely to the roof systems in different voids. These buildings have been heavily renovated. Now the chief tells us one person who was in the building during the fire was taken to the hospital for an injury. Their condition is unknown at this time, but we do know that at least a dozen people are without a home after this fire. We did spot the American Red Cross on scene earlier this morning, and it is important to know too that this section of Main Street is still being blocked off at this time. For now, we're live in Winooski, Lauren Granada, NBC5 News. Lauren, thanks for